Today we're going to take a look at the Canyon 35. This is a 35 quart cooler, which is notable because you compare this against a Yeti, say 45, which is actually only 37 quarts. You're getting roughly the same size cooler, but with a Yeti, you're calling it a 45. With Canyon, you're calling it a 35. So you are in fact getting 35 quart cooler. This is a cooler that's made in America with a four year warranty. If you want more on the warranty, be sure to visit coolersonsale.com to view our full write up. Right off the bat, you'll notice something totally different than the Yeti or say even a Grizzly and that's the latch system. This is a cam latch system. So you're getting this latch up above the pin and pulling down and that's how this cooler latches. And to unlock it, same way. Pull them out and pull them out here. You'll notice on the top of this cooler the absence of a ruler. There is no ruler on the top of this canyon and this is part of the Outfitter series. The handle is a rope handle with a plastic piece. These ropes are significantly longer than say a Yeti or even a Grizzly cooler but you also have a plastic piece which is different. It's not a rubber, it's actually plastic. But Included is recessed handles on the side of this cooler. You have a recessed handle as well as a rope handle. On the outside, a one inch drain plug, which is protrudes out from the cooler and drain cap is actually attached to the cooler. So you'll never lose that drain cap. It's always attached, flows nice. It doesn't cause any interference. The water always flows out to the side. I like that feature because drain caps are always going missing on the cooler. So what makes the Canyon significant different than say a Yeti or even a Grizzly is the price. This cooler is going to run you a roughly $230, which is about $200 less than a Yeti or about $100 less than a Grizzly and you're still getting a cooler that's made in America. On the inside you'll get a wire basket which is very nice to keep your sandwiches or anything else that you don't want to get wet above the uh, potential ice melt. Uh, so a totally solid cooler. For a full write-up, be sure to review, uh, visit coolersonsale.com for our full write-up and be sure to stay tuned to see just how long the canyon can hold ice against a Yeti and Grizzly in our five-day ice challenge, which we'll have coming up next. Five day ice challenge results for the Canyon Outfitter Series 35 quart. Up front, just want to say most surprising cooler. Uh, I would say this is probably the best bang for your buck. It uh, definitely held ice way better than I anticipated. On five days, handled uh, no problem. Uh, I would say that there's enough ice in this cooler to go at least another two, possibly three days. Certainly more ice than the Yeti Tundra 45, which again is a 37 quart cooler. So you're getting th two quarts less than the Yeti Tundra 45, but it's holding ice uh, better in my opinion. Opinion. It's actually holding ice way better than the Yeti Tundra. Uh, drained well. Uh, as you saw, the cap actually uh, is attached to the drain hole, so that's a little bit awkward in terms of the drain, uh, but still drained really nice. Uh, I would say ice is coming up about 50% on our sodas, uh, maybe even a little bit higher. Um, again, handled handled uh, the five-day ice challenge with no problem, and uh, at, a, at about half the price of Yeti Tundra 45. If you're looking for the best Best bang for your buck on a roto molded cooler made in the USA. The Canyon Outfitter Series 35 quart definitely performed well and uh, is worth the consideration. Stay tuned because we'll show you exactly the ice levels uh, compared to the Yeti Tundra 45 just so you can see on a five day uh, ice challenge how much ice is remaining in the Canyon versus the Yeti. Again, terrific performance by the Canyon Outfitter Series 35.